Okay. Decide on the trinkets. Anything else you want for the trinkets? Maybe? No? Probably not. What is this? A race is holy attack. Holy! Oh. I know it's the final boss. That's what Chad said. Yesterday you missed my link, Mr. Force. He was the one that said flip and force. Minus 30, I guess. Potentially check. Not sure if it's still there. All right. I see, I see, I see, I see how it is. for ants damage for fucking ants So much damage, man.
You don't really have time to jump attack this guy. How am I supposed to stagger this guy? Swap the crit talisman. Yeah, you say that, but you don't say swap for what. I have nothing. Don't stop attacking! Why does my, uh, why does my, uh, roll R1 sometimes deals 850 damage and sometimes 1000? What is that? Fast tag deals. Oh, it's a counter. Now it does 1000. At least we figured out that running from the first attack works. <laughs> That's uh, important information. Hello, Mr. Force. I don't mean to be distracting, but have you heard of the Emerita Crustacean? 
It has a bowel-shaped body, a tough exoskeleton, and can hold its appendages close to the body, allowing it to roll in the tidal currents and waves. Pretty cool. I guess. Thousand damage with a jump attack. Uh, less damage than my rolling R1 because the rolling R1 usually goes into counter hit territory uh, most of the time because these attacks have like large swings. But the stagger must be greater with the jump attacks, right? Hello, Mr. Force. So it might Actual be question, friend here. I was always wondering why you don't do slight roll. As a god gamer who wouldn't get hit very often anyway. I am guessing you are worried the playthrough would be shorter in that case. So let's continue. Yeah, you're terrified of yourself. On point. It's too easy for me to roll. Like uh, you're just dead if you uh, try and punish that stone shit, and he does the 360. But maybe he doesn't do the 180 actually, not 360. Maybe he doesn't do the 180 if you are standing in front of him. Oh my god, giga delay on that attack, man. Oh my god. Oh my god.
long range, man. I dodged the first one, start running immediately, and he still catches me with that shit. Heal, yeah, heal in melee, a good idea. I don't really know how to dodge the uh, lightning one in melee. Good oh. evening, Mr. Force. I have a question. Are we going to have to listen to your wife complain like a little bitch for the next five hours? Thanks in advance for the clarification. I don't know. But at least I don't pay to complain. That would be good. What the fuck? What happened to the other videos? I got confused. good is my uh, weapon uh, on this guy? Probably way too slow. Way too slow. My my uh, weapon art. Thing. Should I jump instead? No, I still get hit by jumping, I think. I 
Maybe I, I maybe I jump. Lord. Reaction time. Older individuals tend to have poorer coordination and reduced force and speed of movements. Why does this happen? It's a combination of age-related changes in oh the brain, slow signals from the brain to nerves. to do anything you have to just stand still and charge r2 i did it before but i don't remember exactly where i rolled there is a sweet spot though Imagine a little juice, welcome back. Hello, Forsen. Today oh. I was at Twitch Pond and there was a lady selling artwork with her face. I bought saying believer with a heart because I believe you can win this boss. Also, yes, apparently there are women watching you. Copacin. Copacin, indeed. Oh, I wouldn't be a doubter either.
that one is so hard. You dodge the first one, you get hit by the second one. Let's roll. I think you have to roll to the right on that one or some shit, but it's impossible to see the difference in time. And then you already roll to the left and you get hit by the other one. <laughs> no hiccups. P. One, two. You can do it. Of course I can. Talk to the god gamer, sir. squeeze in an R1 on that one. I think I can squeeze in an R1 on that one. Uh, that will, uh, but I have to just recognize which one it is. I tricked me.
me, sir. I want to live. the map markers no I don't think so Lord, Lord. This is a rough ass. I don't know how to dodge that, because this time I recognize it also in time, and I roll to the right left and I still get hit by the second swing. How do you dodge that? I tried rolling backwards, I tried rolling to the left and to the right. I don't know, that's a, that's a guarantee. That's a frame roll. No fucking way. Now, you see it, I cannot roll that in any direction. I need to understand how to roll that. The, I, okay, even if it is a frame perfect roll, where do I roll? It can actually not be dodged, it's a guaranteed hit. Is it actually? There is no way they would do that for all the no hit speedrunners and shit. It has to be here. Hello, Sebastian. My friend here. The right slash. That slash into cross slash combo is completely undodgeable. Without taking damage. If you dodge the first slash, you'll always get hit by the That's second. what I'm saying. No hit runners just use their weapon to block it. Really? actually did an unavoidable attack. actually can dodge that. It doesn't deal ridiculous damage, but it does deal like a 40% of my health bar. Backstep then roll? No, there's no way you can backstep that man. There's no way. The, the swipe is too big. You 
can, but you need a talisman. Ah, fuck off. I had a talisman. I'm not gonna fall for that shit, dude. It's full of shit. I don't know what to put as my last trinket. I got nothing for this guy. He doesn't break posture fast enough. Maybe this one. No Havels Z equals lose. No hammer build equals lose. No bug or lucky eye patterns equals lose. No modded game equals lose. No mage coxery equals lose. R1 chum tactic turned into R1 chum 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 then I. Good luck so forth you can lose. Of course, I'm the gamer. But not if you keep distracting! Hello, Mr. Force. I don't watch you a lot lately, so don't understand. A week ago you fought a hitter. Three days later it's a night with purple magic on the earth. Now it's just a night with purple magic. Is it still saying we paid boss? Please clarify. Yeah, they all have purple magic. Pretty much. That's the concept of Elden Ring. Copy pasta. Vice friend here. In order to dodge the double slash, you need to always hold into the left straddle. Your left not hit. And dodge the left when he does it. Second swing won't be in the right position to pick you up. I want to dodge the double slash and always be holding to the left of the You're left, not this. And dodge to the left. When he does it, the same thing won't be in the right decision to hit you. Do, that's what I do all the time. I always dodge to the left. Always. And he just hits me with the second one. I think you are... I, most people have said you can't dodge it and the pros just use block. I believe that wrong. See, I dodge to the left there. I dodge to the left, and I spam dodge. And you don't, you, you can't avoid it. You can't avoid it. I literally did it to the left there. Hey, 
is literally a hundred percent get hit move. Delayed ass shit. Play that order. Break his posture, but it is very hard to break his posture. It's so OP, man. It is so OP. <sighs> I'm swinging for fucking ants here.
What a dodge! is just so good versus me because it's like one third of my HP guaranteed for him and my healing is fucking garbage Fucking roll, man. This is a suggestion to level up your subaltry aggressive. This is a suggestion to level up your subaltry blessing. This is a suggestion to level up your subaltry blessing. This is a suggestion to level up your subaltry blessing.
run, you fools. Oh no! Understand when it's my turn to attack. Like, what is this? Does you just keep doing the the light stuff or what? Oh, that's holy damage. Is it not holy damage? That must be holy damage. Yeah, I'm gonna take this. But I mean, seriously, what the fuck? Dodge his attacks, yeah, that's what I was doing. Uh, nice. Good start. This guy is absolutely fucking mad.
That's what I'm talking about. Woo! Clutch. Clutch. Run, you fool. Ah! Ah! What? That's a big problem. Counterattack, and I just get hit by some lightning shit. Holy shit! Right? What? When is it my turn? I just realized a mechanic. Um, 
So when you uh, when you dodge a move and you attack him, he actually recovers as soon as he starts taking damage faster. Uh, but he has a baseline. If you don't touch him, his baseline is enough for you to get a charge attack in every single time. But as soon as you get an R1 in, he starts recovering as soon as he takes the damage. So, instead of getting one R1 in, you can get one R2 in. Uh, and have the same amount of time to react. Even if it's... You have the what I'm trying to say is that... You have the exact same amount of time to react if you do an R1 or if you do an R2. Do you understand? Because his recovery only speeds up after he takes damage. It's true. Which means... That we can play Charge Amulet. Uh, is there a reason for me to keep this... Arsenal charm. Not really. It's like stamina resource or some shit. I don't know. It's true. That that I think is not much to say. Nothing to do with the charger. See? I'm gonna do an R1. Not this time. We're gonna stagger him big time here, okay? We're gonna stagger him big time. Every single time, phase one, we're gonna stagger him, alright? I, I have understood everything there is to understand about this guy. Phase one. Second, I haven't blocked a single attack in this entire Elden Ring playthrough. I don't even know how to block. There's no way you can block that shit.
take. We are going to stagger him right now. Right now. Frozen, 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 frozen. Which ones I can do the fully charged on and which ones I cannot. Uh, it's very fast, some of them. They recover. Very, very fast. Uh. Why 
does this guy even have like two carrot sized swords on top of his the ones he's using? Why would he ever use those? They just distract you with the fate. Probably want to roll towards him. Sometimes they're just very unoptimally placed. Anoroxy, Snake Jack, Suntax, Rise Out Law, Breaking Balls, Twins LP, and Grumper. Thanks for the subs. And resubs, of course. Here we go. This is it. This could be it, potentially. Most certainly. Tier 2 or phase 2 moves I've seen so far at least.
I roll! Is that stamina? Absolute bullshit. Triple smash is also a damn move. I can't even get a roll, roll quick attack if he does the wrong follow up, the fast right. So many of these, like, you just have to, like, not punish because he could have a follow up. It's like the charging boar all over again. It's Boshi time! Brazil crowd salad, LG will save my life and new mode. Thank you boys, guys, for welcome back. Two attacks that are dangerous. There's the unavoidable one, and then there is the really fast right into a. I pressed R2 by mistake. I don't even need the cake. Wait, are you telling me that a charged R2 deals 2000 damage, but a normal R2 deals 1800 when I have even a charged talisman? Explain to me how that makes sense. One is counter it, I guess.
sometimes you just see those meteors and they're like, yep, yeah, there's no role in that. There is no role in that. Those meteors. What? You can jump the you can jump the rocks? Really? How can you slap? So slow, man. You're so like hyper from rolling fast so many times in a row, and then he suddenly does the giga slow. Question is, after the broken move, can I do a charge R2? That is the real question. After the broken move, no. I feel like I could squeeze it in. I'm gonna squeeze it in. Just get up. As soon as I figure out if I can, uh, I just need to min max my damage phase one. All right. Step one: min max your damage phase one. All right. That way, you will get to phase two frequently. And then you learn phase two. Easier. I got out of 
Out of uh, rhythm, yeah? Dance Dance Revolution! Shut up. Why don't you just skip the boss? Then you will just skip. Then you will. <laughs> Because you skipped. Shut up, man! Look at this! I told you it was possible! <laughs> Just skip it. Then you move. <laughs> oh, and the LYL, oh, and the LYL, oh, and the LYL. I told you. You can squeeze the R2s, man. Squeeze the charged ones. With the right timings. The shit that comes after on the ground, on, out of, uh, after every single attack that he has, that shit is the obnoxious shit. Yeah, oh my, oh my lord, don't. Oh fuck, man. Actual shit design. Honestly, this is not even shit design. This is just hard. Right, I'll tell you what is shit design. Alright. So far, there's only one shit design, and that's his double swipe, which is unavoidable. That's shit design. Left sweep is so fucking annoying. It just punishes a lot of my moves.
avoidable. I mean, I'm not gonna drink until he jumps away. Like, you gotta go for the stagger. You gotta go for the stagger here, phase one. You gotta, you gotta hope that he jumps away and you can drink. Can I put like another uh, weapon art on this? Or is this a somber weapon where you cannot? Ugh. You can't stagger. Are you stupid? I literally just staggered like two deaths ago. I staggered him. What? Special at the start. I mean, it's too slow. And it's a guaranteed hit. Just gotta sit there and look at him. Look at him go. Shut. What did he say? Where the backstep the fucking yeah no no one can like a backstep.
shit in my screen, I can't see. No one's gonna backstab that, or backstab that, alright? You can only do that shit if you're ready for it. Because it's too fast. There's no way. There's no way you're gonna be ready for that shit. As they say in Tekken, it's an unseeable load. you're specifically waiting for it you're not doing that unless he has a pattern where he always does that after an attack I haven't actually paid attention to it Stamina! Stamina, mina! Eh, eh, waka, waka, eh, eh. The back one talisman gives eye frames. Too many risky moves. Like you can't, you can only attack after half his moves at this weapon. Too many risky moves. But then I won't be staggering him. I guess. What the fuck? Like, yeah, cover my screen with particle effects. Yeah, hide these attacks behind it. Very good, very nice.
Oh no, motherfucker! Oh, oh. Oh, man, come on, man. I don't understand right now. Is this like you can literally just uh, kill me there? Next crap is the insta kill. Doesn't it know I'm under level? Just kill me. But uh, that's annoying that he didn't do the exploding thing in the, the thing. Faster if you equip more equip load, uh, like uh, not not passing breaking points. You know what I mean? Like if I am lighter within the same category of load, do I uh, roll faster? No. Okay. Uh, Hello, Mr. Boss. I know chat hates it, oh, but wow. I decided to become advice friend for a day. Otherwise, your gameplay is insufferable. On the other end of this arena, there is a good-looking wall to sex that might win you the game, Sexy Boss. On the other side of this arena, it's a wall. You're trying to stall me, huh? I'm already killing this guy, can't you see? It's already dead on my screen. No! That 
That's what I'm talking about. I can't see anything. I need to start running later because my stamina bar is not very big. Uh, and jumping costs a lot of stamina too.
<lacht> Simpsons? Ah, Quest TT, UK are home camps move, like so TD, Marco and Creek on with the seven years, it's force and E. Thank you very much, man. Back. Back, boys. Okay, I'm getting. What's wrong? What's going really wrong? of bitch. Never heard that insult before. side rather than the left side of most shit. That is an idea, I think. An idea. Also, the problem is that I was so good phase one that I was out of stamina when phase two started. So I literally cannot have run away if I wanted to.
not go for that old piece of shit, man. Oh my god! So I don't understand. When he does the meteors phase 2, and then he teleports, I can't outrun that? Or do I have to run away from him? Because I'm running sideways. Yeah, I know that the rolling attacks work, but it's stamina, stamina inefficient, especially after running and jumping. You don't run up, stamina. Yeah. Damage it deals on the first four attack is literally damage for ants. So maybe I just hold block, spam rolling. I will run out of stamina. Hundred percent.
on the jump. Come on! Ah! I rolled! Get a grip! Shrek Twitch faves, welcome back. Welcome. The thing with that move, uh, why it's so fucking annoying, is because you're already ready to dodge, so you press down circle, as long as you hold circle, your roll is not gonna go off, but then it's always a bit sketchy when you're gonna release it, because it turns into running sometimes, and then it's like, you know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about, some of you. start here. Stop it now, Ron. At the reset. We got it too much. It, it happens. It happens to the best of us. Me, of course, literally being the best of us. Tiers plus five only because it's a plus five tiers run only. <laughs> <laughs> 